Hey guys, this is a signed up to 25. Four, I did a fire the other two, day. One, uh, as you can see, I managed to get up to 277 item level on my fire gear. And even though, uh, <coughs> you know, my fire gameplay isn't as good as my arcane gameplay, I feel like, uh, I don't know, it's a pretty fun spec to play. So, uh, you know, I'm trying to play it here and there. I'm trying to play... Um, the all three specs so i can kind of compare them for you guys <coughs> so right here i do flame strike and then i um try to keep uh the damage count which damage count which was called which is called uh infernal cascade up it's the weak rod that i have in the middle of my screen with two stacks right now which i just lost because uh, i was out of combust uh, i find it really fun as well that you're always on combust however uh, I feel like I'm underperforming I'm <laughs> really hard I feel like I should do much more damage than this <coughs> there are in my opinion many mistakes that I still do even not only when I watch my gameplay again I realize this but also while I'm playing I'm like oh this doesn't feel like what I should be doing I should rather do this <coughs> so right now you know I use my combust uh, I'm going to have it back up for the next pool <clears throat> we thought we were going to shroud here, but the tank just pulled literally everything. Um, <clears throat> I've played with the next pack a few times. Uh, he's French, and uh, well, I'm <laughs> somehow French as well, so uh, you know, I've known him for a while, and he's a great tank, even though he's playing warrior. <clears throat> To be honest, nothing really to say here, I'm just uh, doing um, <coughs> flame strikes instead of uh, pyroblasts in two targets, I don't know why, I think I should do <coughs> pyroblasts just to further reduce the cooldown of my combustion with the, the kindling talent that I'm playing. When there's a mob that has under 30% HP, I'm always using scorches so I can generate hot streaks. And right now, as you can see, we still have like 10 seconds of buff. And I'm trying to get my combust back for this. <coughs> and I have it for maybe two globals, so I just lost it. <coughs> I should have paid more attention there. But this was a scary place to... <coughs> a scary pool to try to combust fast because I didn't have any images ready. <coughs> and... Um, Combust generates a lot of aggro. I remember this from playing fire before that we had a lot of aggro issues. And now it's a bit better because it's more constant damage, you know. We do a bit less burst damage on combust and more constant damage since we have more combusts. Uh, here I'm trying not to lose my Sun King's Blessing proc. <coughs> uh, I activated it even though the mob was dead just so... <coughs> you know, just so I don't lose it. I, I thought maybe the tank was, was going to um, pull faster. <coughs> As you can see, I can have combust, especially with Earth, almost every single pull. It's insane. <coughs> and the combust lasts absolutely so long. Um, I think that you should always try to engage a boss fight with Sun King's Blessing ready <coughs> but I feel like it's very hard to control because consuming your hot streaks is the main I mean <laughs> it's the way to do damage so you know like right now I have combust coming back up but I'm not going to use it because apparently the rogue is absolutely blasting this back holy shit uh, I also want to apologize for my voice I'm a bit sick um, <clears throat> I should be fine, but uh, I'm having a bit of a struggle speaking, and my voice is kind of weird as well. <clears throat> so as you can see here, I have three uh, hot streaks, three, four, now five uh, consumed, and the tank just pulled. So um, <clears throat> I just pressed combust just so I can get more damage in. Uh, the rogue was going to focus the relic, I believe that's why I didn't... Uh, you know, focus it. I uh, had my Sun King's Blessings ready, so... 
so I used it uh, to extend combust duration. There I had to soak. Uh, <coughs> I had to soak uh, the charge from the boss. Special coming. And now, as you can see, I have some King's Blessing proc again, and Ur is dying, which means I'm going to have my stacks uh, much faster. My Uh, my fire blast stacks uh, and so I'm just combusting again I have Sun King's Blessing again ready now so I'm just going to use it fast so I can Stand. proc it faster I should have used my rune of power here okay I did I couldn't use it earlier because I had to <coughs> soak the charge from the boss I have Sun King's Blessing again Special coming. I feel like it's really weird because fire is really great for movement since you have a lot of instant spells compared to our game. Uh, but since we're always on combust and you know room of powers and stuff like that, it still feels like kind of weird that. Interrupt three. I don't know why I have to move so much uh, on my Stack. CDs because I was used to not <laughs> moving at all. <coughs> As you can see, my Sun King's blessing is ready. So I'm just going to, uh, you know, use it and combust at Special the end coming. of the pyroblast. So I started with a 21 second combust. <coughs> we also have caught rays as fire, which is absolutely great as you can see. I already proc'd it. <coughs> I was too late on my... Uh, Target you. Infernal Cascade there, uh, so I lost the buff, I only had one stack, I didn't extend the second stack. Right now the boss is under 20, under 30% uh, HP, sorry, so I'm just doing Scorches to generate hot streaks, as you can see. Special <coughs> coming. The more hot streaks I can generate, the... Uh, more combust I can get with Sun King's Blessing. <coughs> I have combust coming back up, but I know that we have a big pull afterwards, so I think I decide not to use it Stack. and just use my small combust. I'm even trying to hold some um, fire blast procs for that combust to be sure I have them all. I think that was a mistake because they come up so fast, so I should have just used coming. everything. Um, <clears throat> I try to go super far here so that we don't need to soak mine at least. Because, uh, you know, <clears throat> our healer was kind of struggling, but to be honest, he healed this really nicely. This is tyrannical, so, uh, you know, it's very hard to heal this boss. And right now, we just, you know, top ourselves up, drink, uh, and get ready for this next boat. Watch your so you know the tank went inside to take the sentinel and all the packs outside. Um, <clears throat> as far as well, I'm struggling a lot with explosives. I think I did none of them. Oh, I did one of them. Uh, Watch your but I feel step. like it's super hard to do anything Shocking. because uh, the only thing I can use is fire blast, and I really need fire blast for like so many different things. A silence here, and the hero got silenced as well, so he couldn't dispel Watch me. Watch your step. Uh, <clears throat> I did dispel him just super late because I didn't notice it. <coughs> and I'm just using Watch my Sun King's Blessing proc again. Again, this was a no voice group, so we weren't on voice or anything. Uh, as you can see, I'm using two Vicaras for my explosives. I'm using uh, the one to count on the top right, and then there's Watch that orange step. one which shows the live count of explosive orbs so uh, you know how many there are up and you don't miss let's say one that's behind you so if you see that weak aura pop up uh, I can link them in the comments below if you guys ask me um, if you if you know you see that there are two up and you don't see where you, you just start looking around you don't miss them <coughs> Watch 
run. <clears throat> so here the plan was to uh, take the small into the urn with this pack and then shroud. <coughs> uh, <clears throat> you can walk in your night fee here, so you can walk faster, that's why I activated it. I'm transformed, that's why you cannot see that uh, that I'm in the night fee form, but I actually am, you can see it on the bottom right. <coughs> I'm trying to have uh, my Sun King's Blessing active here, because I otherwise I would do no damage. I actually trolled so hard there uh, because uh, I had the herb buff and combust and everything. I would have done so much damage to this javelin guy. Okay, he's dead as well, but. <clears throat> but that was actually troll of me. <laughs> I just didn't see the frontal. When I play fire right now, I'm super focused on my. On my rotation and the spells that I use, so I, I'm missing a few things, you know, in the, in the actual gameplay of the game. Uh, what we're going to do here is go left, kill some packs, then go back to activate one urn. And extend the duration of uh, those buffs with the other adds on the other urn. We failed it because of me, because again, I trolled. Um, but the plan was to have 10 stacks on the second boss. On my last sanguine run, which I uh, on which I played Arcane, I we also didn't have the stacks for the boss. Uh, and you know it's super sketchy, but we we still managed to do it, luckily. <coughs> These scribes with bolstering are super scary. You can see how much damage they do. <coughs> Just with a uh, one through a research. Look, I'm like almost dying every time I get hit by one. So, you know, again, nothing really much to say here. I'm just <coughs> generating cost streaks and consuming them so I can have, uh, you know. <coughs> here I just activated my Sun King's Blessing because uh, if not, it would have been lost. And I also have combust back up right now, as you can see. This is gonna hurt. Watch your step. <clears throat> I had to move away from my room of power. That was a bit sad, but I can't just move right back into it. Watch your step. I had uh, <clears throat> a Sun King's blessing again so uh, Watch your I had to consume it so I had to hard cast flame strike <coughs> it feels kind of weird to consume like having to hard cast a power blast or flame strike but I guess step. that's the gameplay right now fire <coughs> yep Always on combust throughout the whole dungeon, that's how this feels. I'm trying to save uh, some... Uh, <coughs> I need to target something first. I'm trying to save some... Uh, Fire Blast procs again, but I think I should stop doing that because uh, right now like I'm, I'm over capped on them. So I have 3 stacks and the cooldown is not regenerating, I should have used them with it a bit more. <coughs> Uh, and here I think the plan is, uh, you know, to open this urn. Sadly, we didn't have uh, uh, we didn't have the patrol coming, so we had to take the uh, the warden pack, and that's not great because the warden doesn't give stacks, so we will actually gain less stacks from this uh, than if the patrol was here. But the tank, I think, tried to do an amazing oh, yeah. job with the. Uh, <coughs> the urn extensions. 
I had Ur here. So you guys you can see my fire blaster regenerating super fast. <coughs> So we will get a stack right now from the scribe and we won't get a stack from the warden. Uh, we have to start walking towards the next because that's, that doesn't give us stacks. <coughs> so the plan here is... Uh, I wanted to go take the small ads. <coughs> but... Um, I mean I did but I just did it super late. I don't know why and I also died so we lost the stacks. That was like super bad of me actually. <clears throat> so I use alter time I use blinks but they are too far so I'm outraging my <clears throat> outranging sorry my alter time so I just I thought the alter was going to pull me back here but I just died like this was so unfortunate <clears throat> uh, I was actually trolling so hard here so what I did is just release use my invis um, <clears throat> I was also really slow. I felt like, you know, I trolled this whole run super hard. Um, yeah. <clears throat> I used my belt here. Uh, not my image, my um, sorry, my mage invis, because I wanted to keep my invis, which was five minutes cooldown as fire, not two as arcane, uh, for the boss. Because with invis, I can uh, you know lose the the target of the thing. And as you can see, we just lost all the stacks, <coughs> so we have literally no stacks, and we only have that lost. But I guess we're going to try our best. I'm not even trying to focus her. Uh, I, <clears throat> I thought somebody might, because uh, sorry, I'm not doing you know too much uh, damage when I do my single target rotation. Um, <clears throat> so I tried to get as much damage on the boss as possible, since without stacks, this was you know this was gonna be super spicy. Uh, I had my Sun King's blessing ready again. <clears throat> so you know I tried to make it proc. I also had her. So I used uh, my <coughs> Lord of Power there to get as many Fire Blasts as I can out. Kill ads. I think I should have used the Fire Blast there. Uh, <coughs> I know I had the Sun King's Blessing ready, but I just combusted to be sure that... Uh, you know, that I uh, uh, kill the ads. And uh, I almost lost my Sun King's Blessing proc there, but I remember to do it. Also typed in combust, that wasn't great, but I really wanted to tell the guys not to pull the three small ads because if we would have ninja pulled, I think we would have wiped. <coughs> so again, here just trying to do as much damage as possible on this ad. Um, as you can see, I'm a bit stressed, I'm kind of pressing on my buttons randomly. Not randomly, but like, you know, not in a very controlled order, it's like I'm just trying to get as much damage out. Uh, when adds come, especially when I'm not on combust, because I know that we don't have much burst damage with the monk and a uh, and a rogue in single target. Uh, the monk is, I mean, we're all kind of doing pretty Kill low ads. damage, I would say, for this boss. <coughs> I blocked this one. I didn't use invis because there was an add, uh, and the priority was to kill the add. So if I would have invis, I had to AFK three seconds until the invis would activate. This way, I could have just, you know, continued doing what I was doing. You will <coughs> I should have pressed my run of power earlier there. Uh, I also soaked that and instantly decursed myself. I didn't have damage here, so 
I was really scared here that we were not going to kill this ad. Uh, luckily, I think the <clears throat> the shaman just used some CDs. You will confess. One because uh, he's uh, healing us a lot and we're not dying, so I thought that that was it. As you can see, we're managing this boss. It's super hard, but it's... Uh, we're doing it, just imagine if we had 10 stacks for a whole minute, 50% extra damage, this boss would have been dead already. <clears throat> you will confess. One way or another. Pity. I thought you the tank died, the monk died, I tried to rescue my thing, but I tried to combust first. I we had to kill that ad or he would have died. I couldn't dress the monk here. Um, I don't know who rest him, but somebody did, and uh, that was really good. So my enemies, as you can see, I have to wait until the 3 seconds activate, and then I... <coughs> I lose the debuff. We all soak the thing here, because the, the... Two AUE things that we had to dodge came at the same time, but luckily we managed to kill this boss with only one death. It was actually super nice. And um, <clears throat> we were missing just a bit of percent here, not a lot, but just a bit. This reminds me a bit of cold front, the way that it's used, so you know, well, we consume some procs and then <coughs> every a certain amount of proc we get a buff, so when you play frost cold front you get an orb, when you play this you get combust for 6 seconds. Of course it's different, but uh, <coughs> it's similar in the sense that you have to try not to lose the stacks that you have. Uh, as you can see I have a... Uh, <clears throat> I have, have my proc right now and I'm not combusting because the ads are almost dead. I also am trying to use the B as often as possible to cancel the scribes from casting and to, you know, CC the ads. So even if it's for just one global, you can help the tank a lot. So I shipped the, <clears throat> the patrol there, but the tank pulled it. And, uh, you know, we're a bit over percent. We need 74.45. Uh, and we already have that before killing this pack, so our plan was to just, you know, skip after the third boss, skip everything. And this was actually not that bad, because by doing this, and then we also ninja pull the sentinel as well. By uh, doing this, we, um, <coughs> we basically can get an extra bloodlust, so... You're going to see our bloodlust is going to come up during the third boss. And I'm going to use it because we will have over 10 minutes, so we will have another bloodlust for the last boss. Not on pool, but you know, even bloodlust mid pool is still okay. <clears throat> also, try not to forget to decurse people here. Uh, my unit frame is allowed me to see when there's a curse on somebody, so it, you know, my unit frame becomes purple. I don't know why I combusted here, I should have used my Sun King's Blessing proc first, but. Um, <clears throat> hey, I'm trying my best. <laughs> I'm also trying to use Phoenix Flames in a way so that my Watch dot you know, spreads properly. Uh, basically, you know, mastery for fire uh, creates a dot on the target for the amount of mastery. So <clears throat> if you have like 20% mastery, 20% uh, of the damage that you do will become a dot. And that dot can spread to the ads around your target if you place a Phoenix Flame. So I'm trying sometimes when I know there's a higher dot on my target to spread it properly <coughs> even though it's not that huge of a damage increase but it's uh it feels like you know i'm trying to max out damage Interrupt. as possible this is when you know there's like a Interrupt. big ad let's say that i'm funneling and only doing my single target rotation here uh, now i'm using my aoe one of course because there are five ads uh, and i'm trying to have uh, as Interrupt. much as i can for uh for boss <coughs> I'm also playing the conduit that reduces the cooldown of my um, of my ice blocks, so I can ice block uh, you know more times. Interrupt. Right now, the cooldown of my ice block is about I think four minutes, and uh, with the uh, my night ability shifting power, it gets much lower, maybe three minutes, maybe two Interrupt. and a half. I'm not really sure. 
<clears throat> Both me and Hidor are, si are silenced here, so we can't really do anything about it. As you can see, I have to start, you know, doing my Sun King's Blessing proc. How dare you interrupt my research! I don't know why I didn't press uh, my potion here. Uh, oh, I know why. It's because uh, <clears throat> I'm not blocking first, so I won't be able to thin. fully combust here and use my my proc because I had to take orbs. As you can see, I'm, my brain is lagging a bit, and I only took three, and that's like not that much. Um. <clears throat> Accidentally also pressed my <laughs> Windows button command there. Um, <clears throat> I was trying to get Ur down, uh, especially since he has less than 30% HP, so I could get more uh, <clears throat> uh, more hot streaks from him. I'm supposed to um, block this, so what I'm trying to do is have hot streak ready and consume it right after the block. So right now I'm gonna cast. My power Range blast, I'm going five. to press combust right before. <clears throat> now, right now I have to dodge this while staying in range of my rune of power. <clears throat> Which was a bit tricky, but uh, I don't know. I managed to do it, luckily. I'm pressing... Uh, I don't know why I did that. I sh think I should have continued to consume my... Um, my something's blessing proc, but I think I did it to get more charges. <clears throat> also, I thought that if I use shifting power on cooldown, like as often as I can, uh, I will get ice block even Range faster fire. back. <clears throat> I'm an alter time here, but I forgot where my image was, so I was waiting until the AoEs were gone before pressing alter time back, so I wouldn't alter time back into an AoE and insta die. Uh, <clears throat> a rogue has now apparently, so rogue will use, and I'm consuming my Sun King's Blessing proc, and I have Combust coming up back soon. So I'm just pressing it. I'm pressing it, I'm trying to get the orbs as well. I think I only got three. <clears throat> but with the blink, I managed to get four. Range five. As you can see, this is still a bit sketchy. <coughs> I'm also running the conduit that uh, makes me. Heal for 25%, I think, or f no, 50% of the damage my uh, shields absorb. So I'm trying to, you know, do my fire shield as much as possible. Uh, just because not only it shields me, but it also heals me. So it's basically 50% extra shield if my you consider it like that. Um, <clears throat> as you can see, my block is coming back in 30 seconds. I only had three there. Range Luckily, five. the healer is actually pumping. He was healing 12k on this boss, uh, which is absolutely impressive. Shamans are also good healers on this boss fight, just because they can uh, heal while moving with their... Uh, I forgot what's the name of the spell, but there's like a green spell that makes them able to. <clears throat> My ice block had, you know, 8 second cooldown here, so I couldn't use it, but <coughs> apparently the monk had something. Maybe diffuse magic with the karma and everything, so as nobody was taking orbs, I just took 5 to be sure I'm taking no damage, and Range five. I just blocked the dot, uh, because the, the boss was going to die, and it's not like I needed luck afterwards. <clears throat> so right now, uh, you know, since we were good on percent, we were just going to skip this with the shroud. So skip None right from here. Have ever escaped the sanguine depths, and neither will you. <clears throat> As you can see, my combust is not ready, but uh, you know it's coming back up. We have 11 God, minutes. That's this is a great, great all. timer right here. 11 minutes for this is absolutely great. Uh, sadly, again, I didn't have my combust. If not, I would have done like a lot of damage here. I'm apparently still doing damage. I don't have no idea why because I know that <coughs> in my head. I'm trying to, you know, do as much damage as possible. I think I had Agri on Ur for a second there because my mirror images were down. But I don't know how this tank was holding Agri super nicely. I told you I already played with him a bit before, and this is not something that. That um, I remembered of him. 
having such a well aggro, like no aggro issues. Maybe it was because I was playing arcane, I don't know. <coughs> Anyways, I'm trying to kill her now just to stabilize. And uh, proccing my Sun King's Blessing. <clears throat> With her now, all of my cooldowns come back up really fast. Uh, also, my Night Phase is ready. I should press it right now so that... You know, as you can see, my cooldown reduction is absolutely insane with Nightway and uh, Ur. Find shelter. As you can see, I'm not combusting again because Kal will phase in 1%, so I'm just holding combust for the next bow. Um, <clears throat> this both tank and healer were insane, to be honest. The tank was great and the healer didn't let, let us die at all, and he was healing like a lot. <coughs> I really wanted to proc my Sun King's Blessing first here, so I can have like a really long combust. <coughs> And, uh, yeah, that's what I try to do. <clears throat> I think I fucked up my rotation there. I should have pressed my buttons way, way faster, but I don't know why I didn't manage to. Uh, this rogue was doing also, like, an insane amount of damage. We had no warlock and no hunter. Um, <clears throat> Find shelter. But this rogue is absolutely pumping, to be honest. Um... I mean, it's also pretty low-key, you know, like, uh, in the grand scheme of things, people have timed, what, 29 on Sanguine, this is only 25, so of course we can time it with whatever comp. Um, <clears throat> me being on my third spike and having a rogue and a monk, you know. Monks do damage in theory, but, like, apparently they do the same damage as rogues, and I've seen... Warlocks do 35 kill all in this dungeon, so... You know. Uh, but everybody plays super clean, we only had two deaths up until now, and one of them was my mistake, you know, my stupid mistake, so it was like an unnecessary death. <coughs> um, I had Sun King's Blessing ready right now, and I didn't use it for some reason. <coughs> Uh, shifting power during uh, <coughs> combust does a lot of damage, so it does I think around 7 to 8k per tick per target, which is uh, in my opinion pretty, pretty good. Having my Sun King's Blessing right now and the tank extends this. Luckily we have Earth, if not I think I would have been dead there. Fine <coughs> I'm just uh, spamming my Fire Blasts here uh, because Watch your step. we had the Earth buff. Uh, that was almost a very unfortunate uh, overlap, but it luckily we nobody died and they really smartly did. Watch your step. <coughs> I've compassed the cup, so I'm using it to be sure that I have it again for the boss pool. Stubborn rebels, you will meet your end. <coughs> Watch your step. I don't step. know why I'm not consuming it right now, Brock. I think I should have consumed it. The Sun King's Blessing proc, it feels horrible to just see it go to waste, it's like I'm playing no legendary. <coughs> so right now I have what, one minute cooldown on my combust and I think I'm gonna get it back for the boss pool. As you can see, Bloodlust coming back in 4 minutes and 20 seconds, so <coughs> this boss is going to take maybe one extra minute and after this, well, you know, this last boss is super long. So even though I bloodlusted that uh, that third boss, well, we are going to get it back here. I'm just doing flame strikes here <coughs> because uh, I don't want to consume any 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 procs. I want to have them ready for boss pool, which I will have right now. <coughs> I'm starting my power blast, as you can see, pressing combust right before, and the fire blast uh, right before it launches, and uh, I engage with like a huge 
usually long duration of combust. <coughs> Doing my rule of power again Watch after my rule of power ended. I feel like I did my rotation really well here. Uh, as you can see, I'm on combust for a really long time. It's been, I think, 20 seconds, 30 seconds that we're in combat, and uh, I'm still on combust. <coughs> And I can be on combust again to do the same. Uh, the blessing, and uh, <coughs> I will also step. have to combust the actual cooldown back uh, from Ur after he dies, so I'm trying to kill it. You can dodge those charges from Kal also with, um, <coughs> with blinks. Uh, right now, I wanted to Watch your step. get the guy, but the kill was rezzing, so I just combusted because uh, I had the air buff and combust, so I actually had to, you know, <coughs> first combust, uh, we just res the monk afterwards. That was a bit unfortunate because uh, he didn't, I don't know if monks benefit from the air buff. But I also lost my Sun King's blessing right there, I lost Watch it because Cal um, <coughs> jumped right behind me. Uh, I blocked this, as you can see, so Carl wants to charge me, uh, just to, you know, not risk blinking into another AUE and dying. Uh, we have 4 minutes left here, and uh, 1 minute 45 Lena, seconds left on the bloodless cruise <coughs> uh, Here I'm positioning myself ready to blink out, but I didn't blink because uh, I didn't want to risk, again, you know, dying for no reason. Uh, <coughs> I just uh, consumed my clear casting proc even though I had no fire blast just to you know do uh, my rotation this way and to have a really really long combust <coughs> Run out. Watch your step. <coughs> I didn't dodge it here either, uh, but I had cauterized ready and seed ready, and uh, you know I was ready to <coughs> use it. Um, right now I almost have some King's blessing back up. And single target fire I feel like is pretty fun since uh, you you're always on your CDs, but again it, since you're always on CDs they had to nerf it super hard, and that's really understandable because if. If fire would do the same damage as it did before, like proportionally, <coughs> with the amount of combats we get right now, it would be absolutely ridiculous. So I get it that they had to nerf this. Find shelter. I think I should have consumed uh, Sun King's blessing earlier. Uh, just because I like I used it after I used all of my fire blast and doing so after I consumed it I had no fire blast or only one <coughs> and I don't know if that's the optimal thing to do as you can see bloodlust is ready right now so I just used it <coughs> I don't have uh, you know combust ready but bloodlust is, is really long and <laughs> I'm gonna have my Sun King's blessing soon <coughs> I missed uh, the ability to dodge there I didn't dodge it I don't know how but And we have 3 more percent to play in 2 minutes. <coughs> That's actually pretty tight, I mean, for the time that we had. This boss lasted a lot of time, even though... Uh, <coughs> even though I thought we were great on time, or we were weren't. Um, as you can see, just consuming my something is best Well, guys, <coughs> this was... Uh, you know, a uh, decent run. Uh, it was one of the two twenty fives I missed this week. I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, see you on the next one. I know my fair gameplay isn't best, but see you on my next Arcadian Frost videos. Have a good one.